How those winds down in Southern California, is that a problem for fire? Low pressure system that we've been dealing with here, bringing in the onshore flow just off to the south and east of us, more towards Southern California. So we are getting some erratic winds coming in and around California, especially in through Southern California. Locally, though, for that Palisades fire, they're just fighting the fact that we have dry conditions, drought for almost the entire state. And for some parts of Southern California, we're now seeing more exceptional drought, which is the most extreme, most critical part of drought expanding throughout Southern California. We're getting some local uh, thunderstorms and showers up through the Sierra. Most of the thunderstorms quiet for right now, but this is what it looked like off towards Plymouth, looking off to the east of those towering cumulus clouds here. Sharon, Sharon submitting that into our ABC 10 weather force, and you can do so by hitting the weather tab. Scroll down. Not only can you submit weather photos there, but also track our weather conditions, which will be changing dramatically by Thursday. Here's a look at our winds that are coming in right now out of the Pacific. So what's going to happen is we are going to pick up quite a bit of low cloudiness tomorrow morning, especially for the west side of the valley, the Delta, the Carquinez Straits. It will clear by mid morning, but then we're uh, still looking at some cool temperatures for tomorrow. Right now, Gilmore backyard, we're clear, but the clouds are starting to trickle our way. 54 degrees for Sacramento, Stockton 58. We're at 63 for Modesto, 61 in Marysville, and 46 now clear for Tahoe after seeing some showers earlier tonight. Temperatures today down about five degrees from normal for Sacramento and Fairfield. Closer to normal though for Marysville and Oroville. Just a little less access to that breeze. Stockton and Modesto 78 degrees, a lower 70s for the foothills and then right around the mid 60s with rain and thunderstorms for this year. Everything clearing out for tonight, but here's what happens tomorrow. A few showers pop up south of Highway 50. Then we're dry and we await this low pressure system to come in. It is a cold storm. Temperatures dropping some five to 10 degrees below low normal and snow for the Sierra below past level for Thursday morning. Highs for tomorrow, though, still right around 70 as we move through the foothills. Highs will be right around 70 to 75 degrees. Five day forecast showing that big drop in temperatures, 28 degrees Thursday morning, 45 degrees the afternoon high. We will be seeing snow at lake level and accumulating snow as well. 50s along the coast, lots of low clouds and fog warming to the 70s as we start to head along I-80. Now the northern San Joaquin Valley, still a few low 80s in there, except near the Delta, a little closer to that breeze. Tracy, Stockton, more so in the 70s as as well as Lodi and Rio Vista, only about 76 for tomorrow, as opposed to the east side of the valley. We'll be in the lower 80s for Folsom and Roseville. Yuba City, we're still going to be at 84 and Calusa at 87. 10 day forecast, coolest part of the week is going to be the middle of the week, Wednesday and Thursday, as that cold storm system approaches and snow is expected for the Sierra.